Hello, we are here in Chawton in North Hampshire. As you can see from the village signposts, this is where Jane Austen, the world famous author, lived for eight years. She wrote and revived six of her most famous novels here, including Pride and Prejudice and Sense of Sensibility. Uh, and today's the first day that they've opened for the spring season. Um, but we are here for the official launch of the Writer's Way, a new 13 mile, mile trail uh, that runs from here. And um, just joined by Councillor Andrew Gibson from Hampshire County Council. Uh, Councillor Gibson, can you tell us a bit more about the Writer's Way? The Writer's Way actually is a wonderful way for local residents to, to access the countryside health and well-being being very important in Hampshire County Council. But you can actually go along it on a horse and the, uh, on a bicycle or walking. And um, it goes from here up to the north through to Alton. And it takes a wide sweep, it's 13 miles in all. Um, and you've past, got a map there as well that we can yeah, have a, It goes a past the Gilbert well. White Museum. So you can stop off and have a cup of coffee and um, it's a wonderful, fun, wonderful location. And then you continue on through to Four Marks. And we're also joined by Councillor Glynis Watts from East Hampshire District Council. From East Hampshire's point of view, um, this route will be very popular with visitors, but obviously it's very important for residents as well. Yes, it most certainly is. Uh, in East Hampshire, and particularly the Alton area, we're so proud of Jane Austen, and in fact all our writers um, in the area. And this in particular will give our local residents and residents from all the way across East Hampshire a chance to come and look at what is very, very beautiful countryside and hopefully move through some of our, our what meant Alton town and see some of our villages as well. Fantastic, thank you very much for your time. Thank you. We're just going to uh, move into the house now. Um, so as I said, Jane Austen lived here for um, eight years um, and wrote um, many of her most famous novels. And we're heading into the historic kitchen where we're uh, meeting uh, Mary Guyatt, who's the curator here at uh, Jane Austen's House Museum. 200 years since her death, and this is your first day opening for the uh, sort of spring season. It must be very busy. It is. We've been closed for two months, busy redecorating, repainting, wallpapering the rooms, putting on new displays, and we've been really excited about opening today, having got everything ready and back to usual uh, visiting with the visitors pouring through the doors, which is um, you know, what it's ultimately about. And we were here today for the uh, launch of the Writer's Way, which obviously links uh, here into sort of other um, towns and villages in the area. And this must all sort of help to add to that celebration. Yes, I think this year it's very much about remembering that Jane Austen was a Hampshire girl, that she was born in Hampshire and that she lived here for eight years and, and died eventually in Winchester. So we're very much in, in touch with the local uh, geography and countryside and, and having the writer's way come by the museum is really important. Thank you very much. Um, so we just head back out into the garden and and the sun is just starting to creep through and um, you can find out more about the writer's way on Hampshire County Council's website including a map of the entire route. <laughs>